hello viewers and spidey alive and in this video i'm going to talk about the event pan and crop and when i come to this footage i click on this icon right here that takes me to the event pan and crop okay so when i get in here this is how i scroll to get my video in and out so that's to give me more space to be able to do what i want to do in here okay so when I hold this right here and click and pull out, you could see that it's making the video look smaller. Okay, so when I drag it in the other way around, it's going to make it look bigger as well. Okay, so I can position this to only this right here so I can get a close shot of him in here okay so i can restore or i can reset this box by right clicking and clicking restore okay so looking at the video like this i can also flip it horizontally and then i get it to be in the other way around so i can click and flip and it gets me back to this side as well when it comes to maxing if you want to max in the video you need to come and tick on this so after I have gotten this tick, I can use this shape to create a max. I can use this circle to create a max. So I can use this also, the anchor creation tool to also create a max. So let's say I'm using the anchor creation tool. I click in here. I click, I click, I click. And the last click is supposed to end at the point where I started. So when I get it there, you could see that it has taken the shape off this side and this side is off okay so in order not to see a very sharp line in here i can increase the feather and make it boot and then the feather in here i can increase it to something like this and it gives me a smooth transition from the crop i just did or the max from the max i just did yeah okay so i'm going to get this off by untaking the max in here to remove all max i can click on this and and press delete on my keyboard to get that angle or that point off or i can come for my normal edit tool and press delete on my keyboard and it deletes the whole max i just created in there so you can also rotate footages or the videos by getting by bringing your mouse to this corner in here extreme corner and you are going to see this roundish arrow loop icon so when you click and hold you can be able to rotate this video to the position you want and then yeah you are good to go so if you want it this way you get it this way then you close it and then it's fixed to that rotation another thing i also want to show you is the position of footages with this event and two okay so when i push this under this side because it's hidden under this footage i'm not able to see what's in here or i'm not able to see this footage in here because it's under this footage okay so when I come to the event and crop tool, I can scale this, I can scale this this way and then position it, zoom out and position this up here. Okay, so I can also do the same for this also in here. I come in here, zoom out and also position this under. And so now you have positioned these two images side by side to each other as well and that's it for this video don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more updates and see you in my next video